So characteristics of successful people. And I have to be, you know, honest with everybody because I'm just a diamond. And you know, if you know all the pin levels, diamond is just in the middle because, you know, after diamond, there is a crown ambassador, founders crown ambassador, a double crown ambassadors. So I'm just a little potato still. So I'm still on my way to success. So I would like to suggest everyone, let's learn together about the characteristics of successful people together with me. Would you like to do that? I hope so. Okay. So my topics, I will give full parts. My presentation will consist of full parts. It's about a definition and sharing the quotes and characteristics and concluding messages. And uh, first, I will talk about definition of successful people because I still need to learn from all the pioneers of our times, okay? There are many successful people in the world. So I would like to share the definition. And second, I will share the quotes from very successful people of our time and era, about 15 slides. And third, I will talk about the characteristics of successful people. And lastly, concluding message to all of us. Okay, here, successful people and unsuccessful people. Let's check. Successful people read, read books every day. Unsuccessful people watch TV every day. And successful people love to compliment, give compliments. But unsuccessful people always criticize. And successful people embrace change. But unsuccessful people fear change. And successful people forgive others, talk about ideas, continuously learn accept responsibility for their failures, have a sense of gratitude, and, sorry, I cannot see my screen, and set goals and develop life plans. But on other hand, unsuccessful people hold a grudge, talk about people, think they know it all, blame others for their failures, have a sense of uh, entitlement and never set goals, even though they say they have a goal, but they never set goals. Okay, see, Bill Gates, one of our, you know, successful, number one successful people in the world. He said, I never took a day off in my 20s, not one time, not even one time. Okay, so he talks about the habits of 10 habits of successful people. He said, first, goal setting. Second, they take 100% responsibility and never blame. Number three, great self-discipline. Four, regular update on self-development. Fifth, daily book reading. Again, book reading. Six, they always organize their work. Seven, always ready to take risks. Eight, they move on. Nine, find the solution to every problem. 10, they always challenge itself. Challenging, okay. So who is going to be the next one? Yes, Mark Zuckerberg. You know, we always, we, everybody use Facebook. He said, the biggest risk is not taking any risk. In a world that changing really quickly, the only strategy that's guaranteed to fail is not taking risks. So according to him, his idea of very successful people, he quoted 10. He said, first, 
take full responsibility for their life. Two, prioritize and do the most important tasks first. Three, create their own morning routine. Four, daily meditation or uh, mindfulness practice. Five, make health and exercise a priority. Six, read and learn continuously. Seven, discipline and self-control. Eight, consistency. Nine, follow through with what they say. No excuses, only results. 10, persistence and perseverance. 11, not afraid to fail. 12, hone their craft daily and sharpen the stove. 13, self-awareness. 14, gratitude. 15, have a support system surround themselves with like-minded achievers. 16, goal-oriented. 17, communicate clearly. 18, good listener. 19, value alone time. 20, love the journey more than the result. Okay, next, Steve Jobs. At 30 years old, Steve Jobs was, you know, left devastated and depressed after being removed from their, his own company he, when he started. He overcame all the obstacles to become successful and, you know, you know Apple products speaks the everything, right? And next, so this is Dwayne Johnson, The Rock. He said, success isn't always about greatness. It's about consistency. Consistent hard work leads to success. Greatness will come. So next, this is a Vera Wang. She is the one of the most famous um, fashion designer called Vera Wang. She said, success isn't about the end result. It's about what you learn along the way. Next, yes, J.K. Rollins, you know, the writer of uh, Harry Potter. What is life without a little risk? Okay, Bruce Lee, knowing is not enough, we must apply. Willing is not enough, we must do. Very simple. And Thomas Edison, many of life's failures are people who did not realize how close they were to success when they gave up. So never abandon. Okay, Walt Disney. The way to get started is to quit talking and begin doing. Very simple. And Michael Phelps, there will be obstacles. There will be doubters. There will be mistakes. But with hard work, there are no limits. Okay, so what kind of characteristics is for the successful people? Very simple. Success is not for the lazy people. Okay? And then, successful people are not gifted. They just work hard, then succeed on purpose. When people succeed, it is because of hard work. Luck has nothing to do with success by Diego Maradona. Okay, by Napoleon Hill. Some people dream of success while others wake up and work hard at it. Next, by Walt Disney again. People often ask him, ask me if I know the secret of success and if I could tell others how to make their dreams come true. My answer is, you do it by working, 
very simple. Okay, so next is, uh, is the habits of successful people. 10 habits of all successful people. First, they set goal. Second, they take responsibility for their life. Number three, they have great self-discipline. Four, they are obsessed with self-development. Five, they read a lot. Six, they manage their time well. Seven, they take risks. Eight, they keep going when they suffer setbacks. Nine, they find a way to win. 10, they do what they love. Next is concluding message about characteristics of successful people by Michael Phelps again. The one thing that's common to all successful people, they make a habit of doing things that unsuccessful people don't like to do. Very simple. And Dick Ziegler, I believe Success is achieved by ordinary people with extraordinary determination. So, lastly, by Walt Disney. If you can dream it, of course you can do it. So, let's dream and work hard together for A70. Thanks to all of you and my short sharing but very convincing because we can learn from pioneers. And, and thanks to all of you here to listen to my sharing tonight and good luck to all of us. See you again soon. Thank you.